YouTube family, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, hi, my name is Christine, and it's a pleasure to have you here. Yeah, and yeah, you, you, you don't have an idea of how much this is so much important to me that you've clicked on this video. Yeah, so in today's video, Tara, in today's video. I'm going to tell you why I was expelled in school now on a serious note. I've tried doing this video like three times and I'm like, hey, I can't talk. People are going to judge me. People are going to say trashy stuff and all that stuff. But who cares? It happened. It happened. It is never... If I didn't tell you, I wouldn't know that I was expelled unless you were in that school. So yeah, as the topic suggests, is that I got expelled and I ran away from home for a week. A week a week yeah a week so what happened is i was in your girls high school if you're an alumni there or a student there still hi 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 yeah so what happened is that i was expelled why was i expelled i didn't really see a bigger reason as to why i was expelled but I was accused of something that I honestly didn't do. So, ah, high school life was so tough for me. So tough. I mean, Usha scale tough isn't tough, but you just have to go through it. So, yeah, my high school was so tough. Form one, form, yeah, form one was, was okay. Form two, form two. Form 2 was a roller coaster of trouble, 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 trouble. You know, na kuona, you're looking at me and asking yourself, how? How are you trouble? How? Well, I was trouble. But anyway, yeah, so let's get right into the story. So it happened that it was, I can remember it was on a Saturday, but I can't remember the date. The year was 2011. I was in Form 3 by then. So... What happened is, it was on a Saturday, I think I've already said that, it was on a Saturday, and normally, we used to wake up, go for break, go for breakfast, yeah, we never used to go for preps on Saturday, we used to wake up, go for breakfast, go for parade, and then do general cleaning, and then go to, go back to classes or discussion groups or something of that sort, I can't really remember if, if it was discussion groups or classes i think i'm confusing my other school and this school that i was expelled from so i can't remember where i was picked from but i can't even remember who called me but i was called and told that i'm wanted in the dormitory so i went to the dormitory and i was tensed because i didn't know why they were calling me at least because i've not cleaned i was a dorm cleaner you know those days okay i don't care you of dry because you will you will get out of the dorm without being fully dressed and you'll be like i'm working in the dormitory so i'll just mop or clean and then i will i will put on my clothes without hurry and then people would send you on their boxes and all that stuff so working in the dormitory was a privilege it was really fun so I was like, when is it clean or what have I done? Okay. Going, the pata matron yoko, the dom prefect or dom prefect yoko. And then, who else was there? I really can't remember who else was there, but I can remember the matron was there. And then, ni kaulizo ati izi socks izi koko. Chini ya box yako ni zako. And I was like, no, they're not mine. Because I, I remember I used to have four pairs of socks. So I was like, no, they're not mine. And my mom never used to buy for me socks of that kind. So I just said, no. So I was like, oh, so why were you putting them under your box? And I was like, I, I didn't put them there. I think kulikwana imitango aje yukitu. Inspection. So the kapatikana chini ya box yao. And mind you, they were wet. So, <laughs> so ni kaulizo, atizi socks ulichukua, ukazia kachini ya box yako, zikiwa wet. 
na mwenyewe I, I remember mwenyewe alikuwa anga amasai I can remember the name but I, I can't mention the name <laughs> but it's okay <laughs> And then this girl said Hizo socks zilipotea kitambo sana. Nilitoka saa nne kutoka tea break. Na siku zipata madini vivyo. Ka we used to to hang our socks. You see we used to sleep on double deckers. So, hii kitanda iko hapa, kitanda ya juu and then apart ni mambao you hang your socks there. Kwa juu so, ati she came out from tea break and then she didn't find her socks. So I was like, okay, mimi siko hapa. I didn't put them there so I don't know what you guys are talking about. So they were like, "Hmm, okay, let's go. So go go and see the principal." So when I go na principal, I'm trying to explain myself why I was why mbona nimepeni ameitwa kutoka kwake on weekend. Akuje askie kesi yangu. I don't know if that. No, deputy principal hakuwa so so even before I skip the story, I'm imagining I'm going to send a letter. I'm going to send a letter. Do you what what? I should not come back to the school or something of that sort. Jinini. For some reason, I couldn't talk about that time. It was four, four-ish. I can't even count. And come on, so many young girls, so you know, many young girls is it is interior. I need to shampoo them. So I need to put a shock. So akaandika akaandika sijui ni nini hapo nisirudi shule tena sijui when i'm coming back i should come and take my 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 belongings and leave sijui what what and i was like okay but si kwa nimeshtuka hata because tulikuwa tumemaliza exams it was i think two two weeks to kwenda shule eh so si nikapewa barua i don't even know kama nilikuwa na pesa ama si kwa nayo but sijui nilitoa pesa wapi ni kambo ni the home so sini i went i don't know if i cried or something i can't remember if i cried so mimi nikaenda so usually because uko kuko na gari used to take a motorcycle ikofikishe to some place in salama or a place called mamambi kupande gari uende penye unaenda uko ndio utapata gari so i decided mumando was closer to home remember our home is in machakos So Momando was very very close to home. So instead of going to Momando, that's what I did. I took a boda, went to Salama. Ni na Salama hakuna gari. Hakuna gari. So I stayed there from 5, 5 to 6. No, 5. Ikako usiku kabisa. So I think I called a friend of mine. I can't even remember which friend I called. I can't remember them. As in have you ever been in a situation where guy something happens in your life and then in a jifuta to automatically and you can't remember you can't remember what what or, or who or whatever happened you can just remember some incidences but you can't really pinpoint that this is what happened so that's my current situation so i think nililala kwa hiyo mama au mimi nilikuwa nsaidia na simu nikapiga because i was a student there was a girl and she was like you can't travel at night nilala hapa and then kesho mke uende uende home So she asked me why why I was sent home. Nikadanganya in school fee. At that time still si kona ski anything. I I was not guilty well or sad or it it had not hit me yet. So nikatoka the next morning took nikachukua gari. Instead of going to Machakos, this is what I did. This girl went to Nairobi. It's my first time in Nairobi alone. All those other days in Kenya and Jordan and Mangu, this is my first time in Nairobi alone. I don't know where Nairobi is. See Nairobi. I think nilifika nilifika said to Jordan ni shukiwa wapi? I think nilifika kitu za city. Na mchana. See Nairobi uko ni wapi? And I'm just there. So I called a friend of mine. And then this friend akanikojea tao. Tukaenda kwake. We don't have a place. Don't ask me. By that time, I was going to go. So, Tukaenda, I called my... Now, the mistake that I did. So, by that time, let me tell you what I was thinking. I was like, I was so disrespectful. 
तो बेटा सीरियसली 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 बेटा टाइम मेरे को सिखो ना जा सीरियसली बेटा टाइम सिखो ना जा उसको लेरो भी नहीं आते सो ओ बेस्ट यंग का कंचुआ वे वेंट टू हर प्लेस टू काका शी डिट हैव कमी व्हाट हैपेंस प्लीज बेअर विथ मी बेअर विथ मी फील जो बोल मिनी जोया था था सो बेटा टाइम मिस को ना जो आ बेस्ट यंग का कुन्दा बिना व्हाट हैपेंस सो वे जस्ट केप्ट क्वाइट can you pass him? I think I had a, a safari of mine, of which my mom didn't know. So, I can figure out and try and get them. I'm going to go and 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 go Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, on Wednesday, your parents are going to enjoy. Hey, I got like you, Koshule. So, <laughs> so, and you have to enjoy, see Koshule. I told my mom to send me some medicine because I was not feeling well. I was feeling in some conditions. So, I told my mom, hey, I'm going to be there because what I'm feeling, I'm not really feeling so well. So this is, our school driver used to work in the ins- institute that my mom works in currently. So um, where our school bus used to pass when it's going to Machakos town, it will be able to get here that institute. So my mom has come to the airport and paid our annulation and went there. So on that Wednesday, the oh, driver and the driver went to the airport and went to the airport. So I see who driver calls my mom and asks her, see, when I'm to my dad, I'm just trying to make a video. And my mom was like, really? On Saturday? Yes. Saturday, now you're only Wednesday. Wednesday. Are you go? Are you go to school? Are you go home? Where is she? I don't know what my mom felt. We've never talked about that. And I don't think we'll ever talk about it because it was really painful. <laughs> it was really painful. But siku chapa. And you can't go chapa. Siku chapa. So, nika kawa uko Wednesday. Thursday. So, me calling my girlfriends, my brother's girlfriend, Nelly Nyuza. Nelly Nyuza. So, wakanzanga kutire si namba. So, my mom used to call but I never used to pick. My dad called and never used to pick. My eldest brother called a couple of times and never picked. My second brother called and didn't pick. My third brother didn't call. And my fourth didn't call. So my, my first brother never gave up on calling and calling and calling. So one day, I think it was on a Friday. Yeah, on a uh, yeah, on a Friday. Don't really pick. Can you read that? I was in pipeline. So by that time the country joined part. I'm in the pipeline. And the oh I could see Bali in a place my shit. It was late, Sasita. It was late. So come on yeah, Pana the Kuja Kesho. You could ye my vasa don't go and bat up. So the next day in Kayenda. I kind of don't know. The reason as to why I can't, I can't, I swear, say I talk on the phone, I can't remember, I can't remember, I can't remember. But what I know, I can't remember, I can't remember, I can't remember. Where I was, I don't, I don't know, 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 but what I know is, place I don't know, my brother was like, really straight, like, um, it was So I don't home that day. My brother came and picked me up. 
kenda kwake no i think it was on a saturday because i can't i i don't know kama ni lala uko or i can't really remember i can't remember but it was a really scary moment in our family <laughs> i don't think if anyone has ever done such a thing in our home apart from this babe here who has caused a lot of trouble to to the family yeah so nearly came to home i was cancelled i was i was asked what happened kumbe we had already reported to the police that i'm lost the the principal was so scared was like i'm sorry she was not supposed to send me home that late a lot of stuff she even asked if i could go back to the school and i was like no i can't go back to that school so i transferred schools i went to another school which had also had its own drama which i'll give you a story another day but then it was life and that's that and it happened and i think i'm grateful it happened because it taught me a lot of things i i really lost my best friend I really loved her, I really liked her, but our friendship was broken because of what happened. She was so dear to me. She really she still is, but you know that clues that she was so dear to me. You see that that one person in high school that you trust with your everything. She was that girl. But anyway, Maggie, where wherever you are, I still treasure and love you so much and I just hope you're doing well. Yeah. That's that was the worst thing that happened because I I lost that friendship and she was she was just more than a friend she was a sister it doesn't matter how much struggles we had but I just liked her anyway that's a story for another day so yeah that's it for this video make sure you like I don't know if you can comment <laughs> but please don't throw shade on me I will cry don't throw shade on me. Yeah, so that's that. I'll see you on my next video.